Within this clip, Scott Campbell and Ryan Malone of Campbell Cattle Company will go through lots 1 through 10 of their Labor Day sale to be hosted by Caldwell Willoughby Sales. Certainly quite an opportunity to be able to listen to what Scott and Ryan think about this great set they put together. Once again, we'll go through lots 1 through 10 within this section. As we said, don't forget their sale on September 3rd on Caldwell Willoughby Sales on Labor Day. Uh, starting here with lot one, we sure couldn't be prouder of this calf. We raised him here. Uh, he's an I-80 out of our 4112 donor cow. Uh, this cow's been awfully good to us. She uh, raises good ones year after year after year. She's also the mother of the, the panda cow that uh, Mike Houston sold this fall um, for record money. Um, this guy we think it can easily be pushed into a state fair or held be more like a Kansas City sized one, kind of whatever the uh, buyer chooses. But uh, man, we think this one's awfully good. Lot one can also be papered as a main. We get into lot two here, and uh, he certainly needs no introduction in terms of his pedigree. A heat wave Mary uh, goes back to the Rocky Hill Mary cow that the Bloomberg family has successfully shown. He'd be a brother to the three state fair champ, the uh, three state fair champions: uh, Ohio, Indiana, and Iowa. Pretty solid calf, all black. Uh, certainly should run in any uh, semi-division throughout the uh, U.S. Um, we're pretty pleased with this one. Just nice, sound, practical kind of feeding calf. Should work in any situation, and he does register as a Simmental. And we get into lot three here. He's a walks alone out of a Meyer 734-6807 cow. Um, this one kind of brings to the table what we've come to expect from walks alone. He's really big and square up top. Great big behind, uh, extremely sound, uh, just a good feeding state fair type of calf. Um, we think this one could be very successful through the winter months at these jackpots. Uh, again, another solid one. Lot four is a Monopoly Aftershock Pistol Pete, uh, probably one of our favorite calves that came to us this spring. Uh, bigger for a Monopoly, real big, stout, square hipped, uh, huge legged, good necked. Uh, pretty solid through the center part of his body. He'll be a nice prospect in one and a fun one to watch this summer. Uh, lot 5 is a is another calf that came from around here. Uh, he's a heat wave actually out of a full sister to Panda. Um, genetically this, this calf is just as solid as we can possibly offer you. Um, we think this one will be a great, great state fair, state fair fat steer. Um, and again, one that can probably be held on later into Kansas City or Louisville. Um, just really practical, really smooth, really sound type of a calf. Great at the ground, really nice feet on him. Uh, just the kind that we really like around here. We get into lot six here. He's our predator heat seeker calf we got. He's a uh, late April, uh, one that's a little younger, but certainly built really good. Uh, really deadly from the side in terms of his neck, uh, his lines. Get out, get him on the move. He's certainly not disappointed in terms of his soundness. One you could certainly feed into a state fair, but uh, one you would uh, certainly wouldn't be disappointed in taking him further into the fall. And this calf can also be registered as a main. Lot seven is a believe in me out of a Maximus cow. Um, we think this calf is awfully good. I mean, really super stout behind, great big bone, uh, huge, huge bellied. Looks a lot like the kind of cattle that are winning right now to me. Um, you get him out, he really, really moves well. Um, again, just super solid, super smooth type of a steer. Uh, we like this one a great deal. Um, I would sure, sure like to get this one into a good home. Um, we think this is as good a state fair steer as there may be in the set. Lot 8's a heat wave, Jake's Proud Jazz Double Vision calf. He'd be uh, one of our Shorehorn Pluses we have to offer this year. Solid red, certainly a calf uh, that is very uh, striking when you get him on the profile. Love his extension. You love him up through his front end. He's got some stoutness. Uh, he needs a, he's a heat wave, so we'll just leave it at that. Pretty solid calf. Lot 9 is a monopoly out of our Strictly Business donor. Um, this calf's a little younger, a little greener. Um, got on a recip that maybe just isn't quite as good as some of them around here. Uh, but we think this calf has an awful lot of future. Really extended from his shoulder forward. Um, really good in his angles. And a calf that if uh, you have a younger exhibitor, he's really quiet, really easy to be around. I think uh, a younger exhibitor would have a lot of fun working on this one all summer long. Uh, next one, uh, lot number 10 is going to be the Heat Wave Aftershock Cheap Trick. This one's out of Scotty and uh, Ryan Dunk's donor here at Campbell Cattle. Uh, everybody talks about their sleeper in the sale, and I guess this one's mine. Uh, one that's built like a dream. <clears throat> Excuse me. 
Looks like a fat steer. Good bodied, good necked, stout and square from behind. Just a little greener to me, but uh, I think this one is surely going to be a handful when you get him into the summer months.